For generations, families have been flocking to the Frederick Miller Spring in Eden Prairie to get some drinking water. But now the city is considering a proposed housing development in that very same area. The critics of the project are concerned it will impact the natural spring there. Here's Fox 9's Bab Santos. We want to keep this clean for sure because it's like the last clean water in the nation. High praises for this water in Eden Prairie that has drivers coming from hours away. It's such a valuable resource. I mean, we just feel it's so precious. At any time of the day, cars are lined up at the Frederick Miller Spring. Filling up gallon after gallon. This is the only water we drink. John and Karen Schoenrock have been coming for over a decade. Just has a great flavor. There's no chemical taste to it. It's just, you know, you can taste the minerals in it. But now that same water is becoming a bitter topic. I don't know why people just don't care about water. It's life. A proposed 50 home pulty development has some concern the spring could be tainted by changes to the ecosystem. Further development here is going to endanger this entire wilderness area. We're just very disturbed about it and very against having any kind of development. Now there's a petition and a Facebook group with hundreds of people, along with a fundraiser topping $3,000. All to save the spring. Pulte says it's scientifically impossible for development to impact the spring, and they've taken additional steps to protect the environment while providing much needed housing. They keep pretending they can engineer nature, and nature knows that you can't. The decision will come before Mayor Ron Case and his city council in a vote on May 4th. If it goes through, the spring will not be affected or changed in any way whatsoever. That is my understanding, and I, that's my commitment. In fact, it would, be be it would be enhanced. It would be better off than it is today. So he's pretending that the development on this piece of land won't affect the quality of the water. And we're looking at it saying this is about biodiversity. Bad Santos, Fox 9.